From Northeastern Clinton Central School in Champlain, the Cougar Sports Network presents Champlain Valley Athletic Conference High School Varsity Girls Soccer. Tonight, the Cougars of Northeastern Clinton play host to the Osceola Valley Patriots. For the Cougar Sports Network, I am Josh Bashard, joined on the broadcast by Robert Pieper. The visiting Osceola Valley Patriots have been fit to be tied this season, recording uh, a 5-3 and three record in their first eight games. The, ch the Patriots entered tonight's game 5-3, and three, as I just said, and they um, are doing well in CVAC Division I standings. The Northeastern Clinton Cougars returned home after playing their last... Uh, they played their last game at home. The Cougars have an overall record of seven and three, and they are third in CVAC's Division One race with a five and two record. We will be back with the opening kickoff and the start of tonight's matchup between the Osceola Valley Patriots and the Northeastern Clinton Cougars in just a moment. You are watching the Cougar Sports Network in cooperation with Hometown Cable. And we're back as we, uh, the Northeastern Clinton Cougars set up for the opening kickoff of tonight's matchup. Looks as if Alex Forey and Jennifer Leuven are at the center position ready for the kickoff. Look for a strong defense out of Colleen Honan tonight for the Cougars. She's been excellent so far this season. And look for Jordan Clark on the right wing to score tonight for the Cougars. They look to seem to get her the ball a lot. Yes, very good point there. Jordan Clark gets a lot of touches throughout the game. And Alex Forey moves it over. Rachel Corre kicks it through the middle. Number 11, Nikki LaBarge kicks it. Jordan Clark takes it. Puts it over to the side to Marianne Duty. Marianne Duty cuts back to the middle. Cross to the middle. Chase to the end line of Alex Forey. Kicked out by number four, Sam Senior. White throw in right down by the corner here. Looks as if Marion Doty's going to take this throw. And the throw gets to Alex Flurry. Kicked out. Johnny Ray Corey comes in with the kick. Puts it in the middle. Blocked by a sable. It's kicked up. Number 15, Jala Carter. She kicks it up to number three, Lindsay Kieser. She cuts to the middle, boots it over to the right side, cut off by Rachel Correa. Correa kicks it up the side, and it looks to be as if it's going to roll out. Osceola Valley throw. Looks like Maggie McGannon is going to take the throw for the Patriots. So far, the Patriots are playing excellent defense tonight. Not letting the Cougars get inside their 18. Sam Sr. with the ball, kicks it. Blocked by Van Leeuwen. Corey gets the ball, bringing it down the wing, cross it to the center. Blocked by Patriots. Forey kicks it, hits the crossbar, and goes over. That was an excellent shot by Forey. The keeper is out. Why not loft one up and see what happens? Yeah, it was good play by Forey, just trying to get the ball to the net. There's a lot of wind tonight, so. It's hard to say what the ball is going to do when it gets up there. It just goes off the crossbar. The goal kick is blocked by number 12, Maggie McKinnon, and kicked out by Rachel Corre. Patriots throwing. McGannon's going to take the throw for the Patriots. She throws it in. Number 7, Samantha Ashline kicks it up to Yala Carter, back over to Ashline. Broken up by Johnny Ray Correa. Kicked up to her sister, Rachel Correa, who brings it towards the middle. Puts it up the side. Tries for Van Leeuwen, but it gets cut off. White throw. Amanda Rabbit is going to take this throw for the Cougars. She throws it in. To Nicole Phelan. Nicole Phelan kicks it and it's blocked. Ball's moved up to Yala Carter. Carter's moving up the right side with the ball. She crosses it over to number three, Lindsay Kieser, who gets broken up by Colleen Honan. Honan doing an excellent job so far tonight, even though that's how Sable's only first attack so far. Oh, Colleen Honan gets knocked on the ground, but right back up. Ball's way in the corner now. 
Manny Rabideau is giving chase. Out to number seven, Samantha Ashline. Fights off Corey. Puts it back to McGannon. Broken out by Forey. Forey gives it up. Corey is giving chase on the left side. But she's beat by Brooke Prey. Prey kicks it up. Corey steals it. Kicks it up the left side. Broken up by McGannon. Carter has the ball for the Patriots now. She tries to put it through, but it's blocked by Forey. Forey kicks it up. Corey gets to the ball. Gets it taken away by McGannon. McGannon throws it up the side. And it's out. Rabideau with the throw in. Over to Corey. Corey to the middle to Van Leeuwen. Van Leeuwen to the middle to Jordan Clark. Jordan Clark steps over the ball. Cuts back to the other way. Stopped by number four, Sam Senior. Amanda Forrick puts the ball right on goal. Looks like Al Sable's playing with a deep sweeper tonight because they know uh, NCCS offense is deadly once they get inside the 18. So number four, Signor, is looking to clear everything out and keep the Cougars out of the six-yard box. Carter's breaking up the wing with it. Looks as if she has some speed. Cuts it to the middle. Broken up by Corey. Corey puts it up the side to Jordan Clark. Gets through. Van Leeuwen doesn't get to it in time. Lindsay Keeser has the ball now. Puts it over in the corner. Looks to be a goal kick for the Cougars. Looks like Daniel Terry is starting to take this one. Tierney kicks it up the left side. Not too far. Blocked by number seven, Smith Ashline. Amanda Rabbit has the ball now at the end line. Keeps it in. Makes a move around. Gets stopped. Lindsay Keeser puts it towards the middle. No one's there to get it. Amanda Forey is chasing it down. She gets cut off by number 11, Nikki Labarge. Good play by Labarge getting to that ball there. Throw in for the Cougars. Clark gets to the ball, then it's broken up by Brooke Prey. Looks like a white push. Uh, Alex Forey looked like she broke that one up there. Looks for a direct kick for the Sable. And the kick is right to the net. Knocked down by Danielle Tierney. Tierney with the punt. Right down the middle to Van Leeuwen. Correa has it. Heads the ball. Correa breaks up the play. Correa chasing the ball. Number four, Sam Senior breaks that up and kicks it up to number six, Alec Alexa Hashigan. Jenna Van Leeuwen with the ball. Over to Amanda Rabideau. Amanda Rabideau puts it into the middle. For a giving chase. Broken up by Senior. Duty chasing Senior. Senior puts it up to Carter. But then there's Colleen Honan who gets the ball. And they both get tripped up here. Looks like they're calling that trip on Colleen Honan taking out Carter. Looks like Carter's hurt. Does seem to be as Carter is hurt. She's down a little bit. We'll be right back when the game continues. And we're back with the start of the action of this game. Looks as Carter has hurt herself on that play as she got taken out by Colleen Honan. She's going back to the bench with her coach. Oh uh, yes, that was an excellent play by Conan. Or Honan, excuse me, but she did a good job not getting a card on that one, keeping the ball outside. Senior with the kick, she boots it, blocked by Corey. Honan with the ball, kicks it up, it's headed. Corey has the ball, puts it back to the Rabideau, but it's broken up by 10, 
Tenny Snyder. Robert who pushes the ball up. Broken up by the Patriots. Marion Duty. She's taken out. Blue push there. That was quite an obvious push. You can't knock someone down like that in soccer. You're going to get called, and then you're giving the other team a free kick. Luckily, she did it where a half, it's not a chance for a ball in net. Holding with the kick. Boots it. Gets through. Corey has the ball now. Puts it into the corner. Robin will give him chase. Goes out of bounds off the Patriots. White throw here. They're going to look for a throw into the box by Corey. Try to get a scoring chance out of this. Corey with the throw in. Gets it to Van Leuven right outside the box. Van Leuven keeps it in. Brooke Prey kicks it up for the Patriots. Blocked off by Nicole Fillion. Fillion crosses it over. Tries to get to Clark, but it's broken up by number five, McAllister. Corey with the ball. Cuts it back. Lindsay Kieser takes the ball from her and puts it up to number 23. Corey coming back for the ball. It's out. Blue throw here. McGannon's going to take the throw for the Patriots. She throws it in. Rabideau gets it. Duty kicks it up. Number two, Brooke Prey kicks it back up for the Patriots. Up to number 10, Tenny Snyder. Snyder beats her defender. Corey's fighting her off, but Snyder still has the ball. Kicks it in the box. Honing with a nice defensive play right there. Oh, you can't give up those balls by tripping someone inside the 18 there. You, on the uh, opposing end, you got to look for shots and win the ball by winning it, not taking fouls. Honing with the kick. Nice kick up to the middle. Curry has the ball now. Kicks it. Blocked by McGannon. Blue throw here. McGannon's going to take the throw again. Corey blocks it. White throw. Corey is looking for, for an open player here. She throws it into Rabideau. Rabideau mistraps it. Number 10, Tenny Snyder, takes it away. Rachel Corey with the throw again. She throws it into Van Leuven. Van Leuven in the corner with it. Tries to make a move. Broken up by Prey. Prey's moving up the side now. She kicks it up. Blocked by Corey and out. Los well, Sables defense is doing an excellent job keeping the Cougars to the sidelines out of the dangerous middle for the offensive team. Yeah, Corey with the ball now over to Forey. Forey crosses it over to Clark. Clark mistraps it. She's chasing it. Now Duty with the ball. Keeps Nikki LaBarge tried to keep it in, but it looks to be as it got out. Duty with the throw. Oh, that ball didn't look to be out by me, but refs is out, and that's what goes. Looks as if Carter is coming back into the game. Looks as if her injury has gotten better now. She's coming back into the game for the Patriots. And Danny Bullish is coming in for the Cougars for Ma Marianne Duty. Bullish with the throw. Throws it into Clark. Clark traps it. She's got it in the corner. Makes her move, but she's double teamed. Lavard takes it away. McAllister kicks it out. Another throw here for the Cougars. Danny Bors is going to look for a throw into the box here. She throws it into Forey. Forey kicks it over to Clark. Clark kicks it in the middle. On net. Saved by the goalie there. Not much of a shot. And the kick goes right to Forey. Forey traps it and kicks it over to Corey. Corey over on the side. Breaks through two, but ball goes out. Van Leeuwen with the ball, crosses into the center. Clark heads it. Clark gets it down to Boris. Boris kicks it down into the corner, chases it. 
McAllister kicks it up to LaBarge. LaBarge breaking up the side here. Tries to kick it up. It was broken up. Foy with the ball again. Nicole filling on. It's broken up. For Corey with the ball again. Kicks up the side. McGannon has the ball. Kicks it out of bounds. Claire Parker with the throw. Claire Parker coming in for the sub for the Cougars. Looks like they're trying to get fresh legs out there and some nice offense going. Corey with the ball. Bringing in the corner. Cross into the center. Broken up. Before he comes in with the kick, over and just over. It's the second time before it was generated with a good scoring chance, and the first one was off the crossbar. This one's just over. Another good scoring chance for the Cougars. Excellent scoring chance for her. She's got to lean over the ball and drive it into the net. Keep it down. Lindsay Keeser, the ball gets it broken up. Corey tra miss traps it. Goes over, Claire Parker recovers. She kicks it up out of bounds. McGannon's going to take the throw here for the Patriots. The Patriots haven't really been generating any offense lately. It's been all Cougars. I would agree with you on that. It hasn't came on the Cougars' side much this half, and it looks like Cougars are maintaining key possession. Clark with the move. She's breaking down the left side. She kicks it past her defender. Clark gets it, boots it in the middle, headed out by Prey. Good defensive play by Prey there as the ball is crossing the box. Prey gets up there, heads that ball right out of danger, and look at they get an offensive scoring chance going up the field. And they kick it up. Carter's chasing the ball down, but Hone is going to get there first. Hone looks to be very fast on the field right now. Another collision between Hone and Carter, second one of the night. Yeah, Honan's not letting Carter get by her tonight. She's going to do everything she can to keep the ball out of the Cougars' end. Yes, it looks as if Honan is playing very strongly tonight so far. Number two, Prey with the ball. Kicks it. Claire Parker breaks it up, kicks it up to Rich Corey. Rich Corey makes her move. But then, number three, Lindsay Keeser takes that ball away. She breaks up. She's at half now, puts it into the corner, but Honan's there to stop that again. Forey with the ball now, kicks it up the left side. Corey giving chase, but it's broken up by Sam Senior. Senior looks to be doing very good on defense tonight for the Patriots, along with Brooke Prey playing solid D. Kicked over number 23, 23 in the box. With a kick off the post, and then Honan boots it out. Perfect chance for the Patriots right there, just off the, fo off the post, unlucky bounce. The goal post, the goalie's favorite friend, when they hear that bang, they know they're l getting lucky on that shot. Now there's a throw in for the Patriots. They throw it in. It's kicked out by Northeastern, another throw in for the Patriots. In the throw, short throw, kicked into the box, given chase by number 10, Lindsey Kieser, but Tierney comes out to get the ball. Tierney with the kick over to Corey on the left side, but it just rolls out. Subs here. Decos is coming in for the Cougars along with Jen Bashard. Claire Parker with the throw in. She throws it in. Broken up by McGannon. Parker with the throw in again. Clark heads it down in the corner. She gives a chase. Senior kicks, kicks it out again. Up to number 23. She's chasing the ball down into the corner. Honan breaks that up. Pass up again. Kicks it out. Excuse us for not having number 23's name. Uh, we didn't get it from their coach, and we apologize for that. And the kick, broken up. Number 7 kicks it in. Tierney gets it. Good stop by Tierney right there. 23 for Osable, that is. 
Tierney with the punt. Kicks it up to the left side. Jen Bashard heads it. Claire Parker is giving chase along with number 10, Tenny Snyder. Parker with the ball now. Deep in the corner. Taken away by Snyder. Corey breaks that up. Samantha Ashline with the ball now. Kicked out of bounds by the Cougars. Throw in here. Looks as if Snyder's going to take the throw for the Patriots. Snyder with the throw into Lindsey Kieser. Looks to be about 21 minutes left in the first half. We have no score here. Cougars got a lot of good scoring chances in just just the past couple minutes. The Patriots have been putting on some offensive pressure. Cougars have uh, four shots right now to uh, Sables two. Looks like they're putting on more defense or offense than they are, and it looks like it's showing off. The goal kick for the Cougars here. Looks like Tierney's going to take it. She kicks it up center. Amanda Fort with the ball. She's putting it up the side. Puts up the right side. Heather Decost is breaking down the side, but it's broken up by number 12, McGannon. McGannon's coming up big for the Patriots here on defense. Doing a great job. Throw in for the Cougars here. Danny Boris with the throw. She's going to look for a throw into the box. And that's where it goes, right to Forey. Forey touches it. Broken up by LaBarge as LaBarge comes back for the ball. Carter has it. Carter with the move. Gets by Filion. She's breaking up right side. Passes it up to Kieser. Kieser gets around, but there's Honan again to break that up. Honan's doing a very good job on defense tonight. What do you think? Honan is doing an excellent job back there for the Cougars. She's keeping the ball out of their zone. Carter can't seem to get by her so far tonight for Osable, but it's still early in the game. Yeah, there's still about 20 minutes left here in the first half. Honan with the ball. Kicks it off of LaBarge and out. Looks to be a white throw. Amanda Rabideau and Marion Duty are coming back in for the Cougars, along with Becca Reynolds for the Patriots. Forey looks to be throwing the ball in for the Cougars. She throws it in to Boris. Boris blocks her defender. Dikos gets it. It's taken away. Senior has the ball. Passes it up. To number six, Samantha Ashline. Ashline kicks it to Carter. Broken up by Colleen Honan again. Lindsay Kieser puts it over to number seven, Samantha Ashline. Brooke Prey with the ball. Broken up by Jen Bashard. Jen Bashard's racing up the middle now. The ball. Good ball. Over on the right side. Decos chasing. Gives a chase. She breaks it up. McGannon gets it back to Senior. Senior up the side. Keeps it in. Goes out. Just barely goes out. She thought she kept it in, kept going with it. Danny Bowes with another throw. Hull throws in a decos, but broken up. McGannon. Decos touches it out. Goal kick here for the Patriots. Senior is taking the kick here. Little touch pass over to McGannon. Decos gets to it, but McGannon stays with it. Um, those short balls seem to go to waste sometimes when you could be sending the ball a long ways upfield, but you only get it just outside the 18. You could get it stolen by the opposing team. Right. Number six, Smith Ashline. Chasing. Kate McAllister chases it, but it goes out of bounds here. White throw. Marianne Duty with the throw. Throws it in off of McAllister's head. Clark giving chase down the side. Clark tries to cut back to the middle. Cross into the box. Jen Bashard 
Gets the ball. Gets a good chance there. Goalie comes out of the net, but defense were there, solid, and they kick it out. Corner kick here for the Cougars. Look for Colleen Honing to come up and take this. Excuse me, she's not going to. Jordan Clarkson sent try and send this one across the box. It actually looks to be as if Rachel Corey is going to take the kick here, and Sarah Katie Hargens coming in for Heather Decost on the right side. Corey sets up. Corey with the kick into the box. Beautiful kick. Jen Bayshard with the head over her head. Hargens kicks it. Just goes wide. Goal kick for the Patriots. Excellent job by Hardigan. Just getting into the game, trying to put a shot on net, get the quick goal. <coughs> Senior is taking the goal kick again for the Patriots. A little short pass again, but it's broken up. Correa with the ball. She cuts it back. Boots it up the left side. Jen Bayshard touches to duty, but broken up by Senior. Senior is playing very, very strong defense for the Patriots tonight. Yeah, she's Colleen Honan's counterpart back there. She plays sweeper as well for us. Sable doing an excellent job as well as Honan keeping the ball out of her end. Correa with the ball. Kicks it off of uh, Sable. Corner kick here for the Cougars. They're going to try to get another good scoring chance like the last one. Looks as if Corey's going to take it again. Look for her to put another long ball in the box with this big left foot she has. Correa puts it into the box. Jen Bayshard with the head, just heads it wide. Perfect, perfect kick there by Correa, and Bayshard just missed on the head. It should have been keeper's ball. Keeper should uh, come out and grab that, but excellent play by uh, Sable, pushing Jen Bayshard to head that wide. Senior kicks it up, broken up by Correa again. Johnny Ray now kicks the ball up to this. Brooke Craig cuts it off, she's in the corner. Corey breaks that up. Duty with the kick into the box. Nice play by Senior again by getting that ball. Danny Boris heads it. It's kicked out by the Patriots. Another throw in for the Cougars. Danny Boris with the throw. Throws it into Johnny Ray Corey. Corey traps the ball. Kicks it over to Rabideau. Rabideau misses the kick there. But it's broken up by Nicole Fillion, who turns it back the other way. Kicks it up to Duty. Duty giving chase, but it's broken up by number five, Kate M McAllister. Good defensive play by McAllister there. Subs again for the Cougars. Chantal Valley's coming into the game, and um, looks as if Alex Horry comes back into the game for the Cougars. Throw in by Lavalley. Headed off by the Patriots. Another corner kick. Corey is getting a lot of these chances. Look for the Cougars put one in tonight. Yes, the last two chances have been very decent out of a good scoring chance. And the kick into the box. Over to Forey. Forey gets the kick, but didn't get all didn't get all she wanted on it and goalie eats that one up. And the kick broken up by Johnny Ray, but she misses that one. Opponent's chasing it down. Forey breaks it up, passes it up to Duty. Duty with the b through ball up to Sarah Katie. Sarah Katie's chasing, but Senior gets to it first. Duty with the ball now. Breaking into the corner. Tries to cross it, but it's blocked. Blocked again by number eight, Kristen Smith. White throw here. Duty with the throw. And the throw. Gets it in the Forey in the corner. Forey is looking for the cross into the box. Johnny, er, Rachel Corey, excuse me, kicks that one in for the Cougars. Excellent cross by Forey to get that ball across to give Corey the chance to put that in the net. Cougars got the ball down in the Osable 18 and pounded it home. Yeah, the Cougars, they must have knew it was coming. They've had a lot of good scoring chances, and they finally, finally get it. I'll say we'll kick it off right now. Back to Keeser. Keeser with the ball, puts it up to Carter. 
broken up by Chantella Valley. But Connor has the ball back now. She's breaking it down. Broken up by Johnny Ray Corey. Corey touches, but Keeser t takes that away. Duty with the ball now. Back to Keeser. Keeser put, sends it in. But Tierney calls that off, and she grabs that one. Tierney with the punt. Right up to center. Corey kicks it. It's up in the air. Duty traps that. Duty's giving chase. Nice play by Duty. Getting to that ball, but broken up. Corey with the ball now. Gets it back to Forey. Forey sends it up the left side. Chantel Valley is chasing along with number nine, Becca Reynolds. And it goes out off of the Patriots. White throw. Lavalley with the throw in. Into Jen Bashard. Headed off by Prey. Another corner kick here for the Cougars. Uh, Sable can't be giving up all these corner kicks. It's like a free ball right into the box. Uh, Looks as if Rachel Corey is going to take this again. Corey with the kick. Back. Broken up by Keeser. Keeser sends it up to Carter. Carter's breaking down the side here. Carter still with the ball now. Pushing it out the side. Tries to get past Honan. Tierney grabs that one. Goal kick here for the Cougars. Looks as if Tierney's going to take it. We have subs on the field for the Patriots here. Looks as if Keeser is going out of the game. Tierney with the kick. Headed by Forey. Jen Bashard with the ball. Jen Bashard tries to put it up to the side, but broken up by number five, McAllister. Chantella Valley with the ball, kicks up the left side. Praise gets to it before Corey does, breaks past Corey. Corey trips her up there and free kick for the Patriots. Looks like Senior is going to take this. Boots it up the right side, but out. Cougars throw, Chantella Valley here with the throw. Over Corey's head, Corey chasing it. Senior kicks it. Big boot but Corey gets to it first. Rachel Corey gets to that ball. Kicked out again by the Patriots. Another Cougars throw in. Looks like Megan Bashard is on the sidelines yet again for the Cougars. She's a big loss for the Cougars not having Megan Bashard back on sweeper and being able to move Colleen Honan up to stop her. Cougars are making some subs here, trying to get some fresh legs, and uh, it's very cold here tonight. Kicked up, Carter's chasing the ball, Honan gets to it first though. Honan makes a move around Carter. Another collision between Carter and Honan, the third one tonight. They're both playing very hard for their teams, trying to get a win here. Senior with a kick for the Patriots. And she boots it up. Honan blocks that. Honan kicks it out. Blue throw. Senior's going to take the throw. She throws it into Carter. Carter now with the ball. Tries to make her move. Gets by Philly on. Puts it into the middle. Just out wide of the goal. That was Honan's second foul of tonight. And she's got to watch not to get caught on those. She could get a card because the ref says uh, she's doing too much with her feet here. Carter with the ball. Puts it over to Keeser. Keeser kicks it, but it goes well wide of the net. And another goal kick here for the Cougars. The Patriots aren't gener generating as much offense as you think they would be. Oh uh, yeah, that's right. Right now they had the ball in the Cougars box, but haven't put many shots on goal tonight. Yes, most of their shots being wide of the net. Forey with the ball. Kicks it up. Looks to go off number 23. 
for the Patriots. Throw in. Labarge knocks that one out. Another throw in for the Cougars. Amanda Foy is going to throw this in. Throws it in up the line. Forey has the ball. Puts it into the middle. Corey cuts that off. Touches it up to the left side. The goalie comes out to get it. She's unsure of herself, but she comes out and kicks it. Good play by the goalie there. Coming out to get that ball. Corey kicks that. On just wide of the net. Excellent job by Corey. The keeper's been out so far, hanging out around the top of the six. You can float one in like uh, Forey did in the first, or Corey did already in this game. Put a floater right over the top of the keeper. Big push there by Corey. She didn't think it was a good call, but ref's ruling goes on the field. And we have a free kick here for the Patriots. Senior with the kick. She kicks it up. Broken up by Boris. Boris kicks it back. Now Forey with the ball. Forey moves it up. Corey tries to cross it over to Clark. Broken up by McAllister. McAllister kicks it up to Kieser. Kieser kicks it up over Carter's head. Given chase. Number 23 with the ball now. But broken up again by Colleen Honan. Another good solid stop by Colleen Honan getting to that ball. Honan and... Number 23 are fighting the, for the ball here. Honan kicks it up. Rabideau. Now Corey. Broken up by McGannon. Prey breaks that ball up. Van Leeuwen with the ball now. Crosses it into the center. Boris gets it broken up by Labarge. Forey kicks it up. Senior there again. She's carrying it up. She gets it to half and passes it over, but broken up by Jeremy Ray Corey. Boris with the ball now. Puts it over. McAllister breaks that up. Senior with the ball again. Senior is getting a lot of touches for the Patriots tonight on D. Boris breaks that up, kicks it up the side. McAllister kicks it. Goes through Clark's legs, but Boris there. Clark's coming into the box, but goalie comes out and stops that. Uh, offsides for the Cougars. That was... It looked pretty close on the kick, but ref said it was offsides. Labarge with the ball for the Patriots. Labarge kicks it into the middle, but Rabideau breaks it up. Rabideau's breaking it in now. Rabideau puts a ball on net. Rolls, goalie gets to it. Easy stop for the goalie. We have about five minutes left here in the first half. The Cougars are leading 1-0. Carter has the ball for the Patriots. Breaks it over on the left side. Labarge gets it broken up by Forey. Mistrap by McAllister. Clark gets the ball. Clark with the shot from the 18. Just wide. Looks like uh, Senor is looking for a call there. Johnny, er, Jordan Clark excuse me, stepped on her heels as she was running after it. It's not a trip unless it's intentional. Goal kick here for the Patriots. Senior is going to take this again. And the kick. A little, a little short kick up the side to Labarge. Labarge gets the ball. Kicks it up to Kieser. Kieser deflects it off. Now Rabideau with the ball. Rabideau gets it broken up by Kieser. 23 for the Patriots. Forey breaks that one up. Kicks it up the side. Clark's chasing it down. McAllister gets to it first. Goes off of Patriots though and throw in. Throw in to Forey. Prey breaks it up. Filion mistraps that. But gets to it before it goes out. But broken up by number 23. Pushes it up to Carter. Carter chasing it. Honan also chasing. Honan gets to it first. Honan makes a move. Makes a nice move to get by right there, but she's broken up. Cougar throw in here. Amanda Rabideau with the throw. Throws it up the side to Jordan Clark. She misses it. McAllister gets it. Gets it up. Corey has the ball now. Corey kicks it up the side. Senior is back again with, to get that ball. Corey. Oh, looks like they got tripped up here. Clark and Senior get tripped up. 
free kick here for White. Yeah, Jordan Clark's going hard at the ball, and Signor, or Senor, excuse me, comes under and takes her out for the trip. Clark with the kick here. Crosses it across field. Intended for Forey. Forey gets the ball. Forey gets it broken up by Kieser. Now Honan with the ball boots it up into the 18, and the goalie comes out to get it. Good play by the goalie there for Patriots. Yes, well struck ball, and uh, keeper came out set and called for it, and she got it. McGannon deflects it. Senior with the ball. Senior with the kick. Up to Corey Knox. That one out of the air. Rabideau with the ball gets it broken up by Keiser. Keiser on the right side. Gets by Rabideau. Pushes it up to number 23. Over to Carter. But broken up by Honan again. Honan with the ball now. About two minutes left here in the second half. It's four he kicks it up the side. Or the first half, excuse me. Clark with the ball now. Clark with a nice ball over to Van Leeuwen. Van Leeuwen traps it. Little miscommunication there between Van Leeuwen and Sarah Winters. And Prey breaks that up and puts it up to Kieser. Johnny Ray coming on. Kieser gets by. But Honan's there to break it up again. And Honan and Carter run into each other once again for the fourth time in this game. Forey puts it up the side to Duty. Over to Forey again. Forey kicks it up the side. Van Leeuwen's chasing. McGannon passes back to Senor. Senor makes a move over to the side. Kicks up, kicks it up the left side. Up to Keiser, but Keiser knocks it out. Cougar throwing. Looks as if Amanda Forey is going to be taking this one. She throws it in. Gets through. Labarge. Van Leeuwen kicks it to the center. Over to Rabideau. But it's broken up by number 10, Teddy Snyder. Carter gets onto that one. Breaks it up. Gives Corey a little push and breaks up the side. Kicks it up, but Honan breaks that up. Miss traps it there, but she still recovers and kicks it up. Patriots are looking for the equalizer in the closing 30 seconds of the, of the first half. Prey kicks it over to Snyder. Broken up by Rabideau as she heads it up the side. White throw as it goes off Snyder. Rabideau with the throw. Prey kicks it, and that's the end of the second half. At the end, or at the end of the first half, excuse me. As we come back for the second half, the Cougars lead this game one nothing. And we're back for the second half of tonight's game as the Cougars have a one nothing lead here over the Osceola Valley Patriots. Patriots getting ready for their kickoff. The second half. The shots at the end of the first half were eight for the Cougars and three for Osable. One of those three shots for the Patriots was a quality shot going off the post there. So it's not like they haven't had any scoring chances tonight in this game. I agree. Patriots are getting ready for the kickoff to start the second half here. All the players are moving around. That is so cold. Looks as if Carter and Lindsey Kieser are going to be taking the kickoff for the Patriots. What do you think of the game so far, Rob Ert? Excellent, excellent game so far. Been fast pace. It's cold. They're keeping themselves warm by s running real fast. This is a high intensity game, and it's only one nothing at the end of the first half. So that means look for more scoring opportunities in the second. And the kickoff card touches the keyster. Back to number five, McAllister. Broken up by Corey. Corey puts it over. McAllister, McAllister and Clark are chasing. Clark comes out with the ball. Clark with the move. Broken up by McAllister. Kicked out of bounds. White throw. Clark
Clark with the throw. Now Clark gets the ball back. Headed by Corey in the middle of Jen Bayshard with the ball, broken out by Senor. Rabbit with the ball now. Makes her move around the barge, broken up by McGannon. But Rabbit with the ball back, puts it over to Jen Bayshard who misses it. Goalie comes out, gets it. Good play by the goalie there, calling off her defenseman. The kick. Duty's giving chase on the side. Duty throws it in to Clark. Clark now puts it over. Bayshard comes out for the ball. Touches it into the middle. Just wide of the net. Excellent play there by the Cougars. Looking to keep the ball out wide. And then make a nice cross in the box as the lights come on here on Cougars home turf. Clark with the ball now in the corner. Clark crosses it. Headed by Senor. Duty now. Gets it broken up, but Clark has the ball again. <laughs> Clark with the ball. Makes her move. Cross into the center. Broken up by Senor again. Corey now. Stops that. Foray breaks it into the middle. Foray kicks it over to Corey. Corey with the ball now. In the left side. Makes her move. Cross into the middle. Off of Foray. Corey with the kick. Back to her sister, Larry Corey. Broken up. Rabbit with the ball. Kicks it. Off Corey. Now, Senior kicks it out for the Patriots. Ball's up in the air. Trap my own Kelser. Duty with the kick. Well wide of the net. Goal kick for the Patriots. Yes, uh, Senor is doing a good job out back on the sweeper position, keeping the ball out of the box and looking to give the Cougars a chance, or uh, the the, pre uh, the Patriots a chance to come back in this game. Tenny Snyder kicks it up for the Patriots. Broken up by Philly on Philly and kicks it up the side. Corey misses that ball. LaBarge gets knocked down by Corey. Rabideau with the ball. Rabideau is very, looks to be very quick out there on her feet. Corey crosses into the center. Nice left foot by Corey. Goal kick here for the Patriots. Kick. LaBarge gets it broken up by Rabideau. Rabideau chasing to the side, keeps it in. Touches over back to Rabideau. Rabideau tries to touch it back to the corner to Corey, but it's broken up. Snyder with the ball. She kicks it out. Fillion comes in to cut that off. Miss traps it. Keeser gets it. Keeser's chasing up the line, gets past Fillion. She battles, gets taken down by Fillion. Corey comes back with the ball. Corey kicks it up to the left side. Just goes out. Throw in by LaBarge. Kicks it in. Snyder broken up by Foray and touched out. A throw in here for LaBarge. She throws in to Carter. Carter mistraps it and Foray kicks that out. Jen Bayshard traps that. Kicks it up to Clark, but it's broken up by McAllister. Kalser, nice play getting to that ball. Kicks it up to number nine, but it's broken up by Amanda Forey. Forey with the ball now. Number nine, Becca Reynolds gets it back, crosses it into the center. Carter with the ball. Colleen, or Colleen Honan comes to that ball very quickly, but now Keith has it back, broken up by Fillion. Fillion's going to get the ball out, out of the trouble zone there. Rabideau touches it up to Corey. Corey over to Forey. Nice, nice play back to Corey. A little give and go there. Corey puts it up. Clark chasing the ball down. Clark crosses into the center, right on goal. Jen Bayshard was there, but the goalie comes out to get that. 
excellent job by the keeper so far tonight. Keeping the ball out of her net. Only letting one in with all the shots the Cougars are putting on. 11 to be exact. Good point. Cougars are putting on a lot of shots here tonight. A lot of pressure too. Lindsay Keister with the ball. Gets by one, but Corey breaks that up. Corey kicks it up to Bayshard, but it's broken up by Snyder. Or, um, Senior, I mean. Senior kicks it up through Corey. Broken up. Corey now. Nice play. Passes it up. Brooke Prey heads that one out of harm's way. Kicked up. Colleen Honan's chasing this one down. Getting chased by Tiny Snyder. Honan makes the move. Pushes the ball up to Corey. Corey makes a nice trap and puts a through ball up the side. Jen Bayshard is giving a chase, but it's broken up by Brooke Prey. Alex Foray coming down, trying to take the ball away from the barge here. Johnny Ray Corey is chasing the ball as Keister has it. She breaks it up. A little pushing going on here. Keister still with the ball. Nice move by Keister, broken up by Corey. Her sister Rachel now hits the team and it goes out. White throw. Corey with the throw. Throws it into Forey. Nice throw. Forey with the ball. Makes her move. Passes it over to Jordan Clark who's chasing it to keep it in. She keeps it in. She's got time here. She sets up and boosts it into the middle for Jen Bayshore, but it's broken up by Senior. Alexa Hashkin now with the ball. Kicks it up to Keiser, but Honan gets to that. Makes a nice step over move. Honan with the ball now. Kicks up the left side to Rabidou. Rabidou up the side. Little touch pass up to Corey. Corey cuts over and gets to it. Corey makes her move. Off the Patriots. Rabidou with the ball now. Corey doing an excellent job on the left side tonight for the Cougars. Generating a lot of offense for them so far tonight. Look for Corey to get a goal in the second half. Duty with the ball. Duty now. Kicks it up. Clark chasing it. Broken up by Snyder. Snyder kicks it up. But Forey cuts that off. Collision here. Forey is down. But looks as if she's getting up slowly. Keister with the ball for the Patriots. Touched over. Honan gets there to cut that off before Snyder gets to it. Honan makes a move. Off of the barge. White throw in. Looks as if we have some subs coming in. Claire Parker, Rachel Everleth, and Danny Boris are coming in for the Cougars. Cougars are trying to get some fresh legs out there. Also some warm legs. It's very cold out here tonight. Yes, I agree with you. It's about 35 degrees and about zero with this wind chill so far tonight. Everyone here is wrapped up in blankets, but they're still cheering hard for their teams. Bayshard now in the corner with the ball. Cross into the center. Broken up by Senor. Claire Parker mistraps that. But Fillion cuts that back off. Oh, Parker pushes it over to Corey. Corey on the left side. Puts it into the center. Nice cross by Corey. But no one getting to it. Just a little ahead of everyone. Nice play there. Goal kick here for the Patriots. Yes, this is going to be a beautiful goal kick. I can feel it. Look for this to go up to the left side. Senior with a nice goal kick. But it's broken up by Forey. Forey heads the ball. Forey now with the ball. Gets taken down. And it goes out. Another goal kick here for the Patriots. The Patriots haven't really got the ball inside the 18 of the Cougars' defense here tonight in the second half. Yes, that's correct. And Tierney hasn't had much work also back on defense. I'm sure if uh, Sable puts a couple shots on, make her work, maybe she'll make a mistake. You'll never know. And Everless kicks the ball out of bounds and another goal kick here for the Patriots. The Patriots did have one good scoring chance back in the first half, though, when the ball hit the uh, pulse, and Tierney was thanking God for that one. Yes. Throw 
throwing here for the Patriots. Looks as if McGannon is going to take it for the Patriots. Throws it in to Keeser. Back to McGannon. McGannon touches it through. And it goes out of bounds here. Another throw in here for the Patriots. Throwing in to Keeser. Keeser with the ball. Makes her move on Johnny Ray Correa. Keeser now touches it over to Snyder. Back to Keeser. Perfect play. And Honan takes her out. It's the third foul of the night for Honan. Yes, uh, Honan's had a lot of tripping calls. Look for them to put a shot on that. Look for something to go on here. So now we have a free kick just outside the 18 here. Cougar is setting up a wall. Looks as if Keeser is going to take the kick for the Patriots. And the kick. Nothing really generated off of that. Goal kick for the Cougars. Tierney takes all the goal kicks for the Cougars. Sends them up the wings to get him out. Tierney kicks out up to Boris. Nice kick there. Boris traps it, but taken away by Keeser. Keeser moving up the side now. Keeser with the ball. Sends it into the 18. Philly on break side up, though. Keeser with the ball again, but it's broken up by Amanda Forey. But Keeser now still has the gets the ball back. Forey breaks that up again. Forey kicks that up the, the side. Rachel Everett chips that one into the middle. Corey is coming across to get that. Corey boots it up. Senior with a nice uh, chest trap, and then she kicks it out. Cougars throw. Yes, Cougars have had many chances so far tonight. Getting it inside the uh, Sable half and doing well moving the ball around. Yes, but they don't have much to show for it as they've only scored one goal. The goalie's been playing very good for the Patriots. Corey with, now with the ball just inside the 18, but it's broken up. Coming in is Nicole Fillion to get that ball. Fillion makes a move, boots it in. Corey gets that, traps it, goes back to Fillion. Fillion puts it on goal. Goalie comes out and stops that one. Nice play by the goalie once again. That was his number 13 for the Cougars tonight on shots. They're doing a well, good job putting them on the net and getting scoring opportunities. Yes, they are having a lot of scoring opportunities here tonight. They're just trying to capitalize on a couple more here. Ashigan with the ball now. Puts it up. Broken up by Forey. Forey chasing the ball down. Number nine. Becca Reynolds now with the ball. Broken up by Forey. Now Keeser comes with the ball. Keeser's very fast out there. She gets a lot of touches tonight. But it's broken up. Corey with the ball. Number 23 is chasing. Nice play. Nice slide tackle by Corey moving that ball up. But looks as if Corey was confused there. She thought it was a white throw. But looks to be a Patriots throw as we have subs coming back on the field. Yes, this is a good substitution for the Cougars. Bringing their starters back on. Now that they've had a chance to uh, take a rest on the bench. While there's 29 minutes left in this half. Patriots get the ball, but Corey moves that back out <clears throat> to the side. Just out. McAllister with the throw in here. Flores heads that one out again. Another throw in for the Patriots. McAllister throwing this in again. Throws it into the wide open Hashigan. Hashigan puts it over to number 14, Johnny Rechney. Puts it back to Hashigan. For a Puts that up to Clark. Clark chasing the ball. Senior there again to break that up. Senior is playing very good defense tonight for the Patriots, breaking up a lot of plays. Yes, she's their key defender back there, stopping everything the Cougars are throwing at her. One unlucky break in the first half, but she's keeping her team in it. Yes, and the ball kicked in, picked up by Tierney. That's the first really um, shot this half that Tierney has had to come out and Take care of the ball. We're almost halfway through the second half here. As there's just about just under 25 minutes. 
and the ball here is thrown in by Labarge. Labarge over to Hashkin. Hashkin with the ball. Makes her move around Foray. Gets into the 18, but Honan breaks that up and kicks it out. Sarah Katie Hargan chases, but just doesn't get there in time. Keister with the ball. Looks to make a move, but it gets broken up by Foray. Clark gets to that ball. Prey passes it back to McAllister. McAllister kicks it up. Corey breaks that one up. Puts it up to Clark. Clark chasing it down with McAllister. Keeps it in. It's rolling down the side here. And um, Hashkin gets to that ball. Clark chases her down, and it just goes out. We have subs coming in again for the Cougars. Yes, Cougar subs coming back on. Looks like uh, Chantel Lavalle is coming in on the left side. Claire Parker going out. Duty with the throw in for the Cougars. Throws it in. Missed by Prey, but broken up by Senior. Senior is breaking up the middle with it. She kicks it up. Touched by Hardigan. Colleen gets the ball. Tries to step over. Just misses it. Keeser kicks the ball up. No one is there, and Tierney comes out to get that ball. Excellent job by Tierney coming off the line and holding, not letting Keisher come through with the ball. The punt is kicked up. Clark heads it. Senior now at the ball. Senior makes it, tries to make a pass over to Clark. Blue throw in. McAllister with the throw in here. Goes out, blue throw in again. McAllister with another throw. Throws in to Keiser. Keiser gets double teamed. Duty kicks it up, but it gets back. Corey with the ball. Marion Duty misses that one and it goes out. Blue throw, or excuse me, white throw. Duty with the throw in. Duty throws it in up to Forey. Forey kicks it up. Clark heads that ball. Tries to chase it down. But Brooke Prey gets to it first. And it goes out. Another throw in for the Cougars. Duty with the throw in. Ball goes out again here. Another throw in for the Cougars. Duty looks to be taking the throw. She throws it into Corey. Johnny Ray Corey kicks it over to Hardigan. Hardigan touches it to Corey, or er, Forey, excuse me. Forey tries to get in the center, blocked by Prey. Prey kicks it out to the outside, but Clark gets to that, tries to make a move, but it's broken up. Kicked up the side and out again. Another Cougar throw in. Yes, Cougars having a lot of throw ins on the right side. Look for them to switch fields and get some offense going on the left side. Haven't seen much of that so far this half. Yes, most of the play has been on the right side. And the ball just keeps going in and out of bounds here for the past few minutes. Before he chases that ball down. Gets to it. Kicks up the side. Clark now with the ball on the right sideline. Clark tries to make a move. But it goes out. Another throw in for the Cougars. Clark here. Clark throws it in. Tries intended for Hardigan, but it's broken up. McAllister with the ball here. These winds in excess of 20 miles an hour tonight are coming in here real hard. And the Cougars seem to be playing that well, keeping the ball in bounds, not letting the wind be a factor. And we have a goal kick here. It looks like uh, Senior is going to take it again. Right on the ground, tries for the short one, but it gets broken up. Forey with the ball. But that yeah, gets broken up also. Up to Keister. Keister now with the ball. Amanda Forey kicks that one back. Goes out. Throw in here. McAllister's taking it again for the Patriots. Throws it in. Forey breaks that up and it goes out. Looks as if number eight, Kristen Smith, is going to take that. Throw in. Nope, excuse me. McAllister is going to take it. Throws it in. To number 14, Johanna Resny. Resny chasing it down. Goes out, blue throw here, deep in the corner. This is about the deepest the Patriots have had this ball this half. 
Throws it in. Keister with the ball. Keister makes a move in the center. Keister with the kick on goal. Just wide. Nice try by Keister. Trying to get a team an equalizer here. When you're down by one, there's one half of the left. One half left to go, or uh, half of the half to go here. You want to put some shots on net and create scoring opportunities. Unfortunately, that one just went just wide. Yeah, we were just just about 19 minutes left in the second half, and the Patriots are trailing one nothing. They want to try to get this equalizer here. Corey breaks that up, pushes it up to Rabideau. Rabideau puts it over to Decos. Decos gets it broken up by Prey. Senior at the ball, just breaking it up the side, pushes it over to number 10, Tenny Snyder, but broken up by Fillion. Prey kicks that ball up to number 8, Johanna Resny. Number 10, Tenny Snyder here with the ball, right here on the sideline. Being guarded by Chantel Lavalle. Lavalle breaks that up. But Keister gets that ball. Keister comes to the ball. Tries to touch it over. Snyder gets it back. Touches back to Keister. Keister to the 18. Honan breaks that up again. Honan kicks it out. Ball gets inside the Cougar 18. Honan comes out and boots it right out of bounds. Good job. Not letting your opponent get any scoring chances. Another throw in here. White throw in this time. Philion's going to take it. Philion throws it out the side. Chantel Valley gets blocked, but Corey kicks it up to Van Leeuwen. Van Leeuwen missed traps that, and it's kicked back in. But Corey traps that and gives it over to Rabideau. Rabideau tries to make a move, but it's broken up by Hashkin. Hashkin gets it to the side. She's chasing it down, and she gets it to the ball right here in the corner. Crosses it into the 18, but Honing's there to break that one up. Honing kicks it up to Van Leeuwen. Van Leeuwen traps it. Snyder br tries to break that up, but she gets it over to Corey. Corey touches back through. Prey now kicks it up. Rabadou breaks that up. Miss miss trap though, and Snyder Senior has the ball for the Patriots. White throw here. Looks as if Mary and Dooney's gonna take it. Another sub coming in for the Cougars. Danny Bowers is coming back onto the field. Yes, Danny Bowers coming back on. Doing a very good job tonight. Looks like Josie Gilroy subbing in a lot. Get some offense. Keep her players warm. Yes, it's very cold out here tonight. The Patriots don't have the luxury of the bench, though. They only look to have four players on the on their bench right now. Hashkin with the kick. Just wide. Tierney tracked that one all the way, and it goes just wide of the net. Excellent shot by Hashkin. If that was... On net, that was definitely going in. You would have tucked right underneath the crossbar. Look for her to be taking more like those. Nice shot by Hashkin. Just wide, though. Tierney with the goal kick. Keiser heads that ball. But Honan comes out and boots it. Headed by Senior. Corey comes to get that, but it's broken up by McAllister. McAllister tries to kick it up, but Duty's there. Duty boots it up the side. Heather Decos is chasing. Yes, Heather Decos comes on for the Cougars. <clears throat> in the game before, she scored the start, the goal to put the Cougars into overtime. She's doing very well so far this season. Keiser with the ball now, breaks past her defenders, tries to put it in the middle to Carter. Carter with the ball, kick just wide again. Another good scoring chance for the Patriots here. Carter, just like Hashigan, looking for the upstairs shot on Tierney. Look for more of those. They keep bringing the pressure here in the second half. Tierney with the kick here. Broken up by Keiser. Keiser now. Carter with the ball, but it's broken up. Carter back with the ball. Cuts it to the center. Touches it over to Keiser. Into the box. But Tierney comes out and picks that one up. Tierney with the punt. Kicks it, tries to keep it low because of this win, but it goes out off of the Patriots. Cougars ball here with 14 minutes and 50 seconds left. Throwing in.
looks to be a penalty on Rachel Corrier. Free kick here for Snyder. She's going to take the kick for the Patriots. And she kicks it out to Keister. Keister deflects that. Over to the side, giving chase, out of bounds, white throw. Yes, um, Rich Corey, that was an unneeded foul up there at half. Let your opponent shoot from there, they're never going to score. Unneeded foul. Right, unneeded. Ravio is going to be throwing it in here for the Cougars. Throws it in, intended for Corey. Corey traps the ball, but it's broken, broken up there, but Keister now with the ball. Touches it to Snyder. Snyder with a good foot tries to push it into Carter. Amanda Forey breaks that up. Keister with the ball again, puts it on just wide. They're getting a lot of good looks here in the past few minutes in the second half. Cougars need to regain some offense here. Get the ball up. It's been in their half for the past five minutes right now. Tierney with the kick. Keys here with the ball now. Looks to be a handball, but no call by the ref. Number seven, Samantha Ashline kicks the ball up. Just goes out. Cougar throw. Rachel Corey is going to throw this one in. Up to Forey. Miss trapped. McAllister kicks it up. Intended for Keys here, but Keys just misses it. Going here by the Patriots. Subs coming in. Subs coming in. Looks as if Patriots throw it in. Number six, Hashkin, who had that nice scoring chance earlier with the ball. Puts it in. Keys her into the box. Kicks it just wide again. Yeah, you can't score if you don't put the ball on that. They, they need to get these shots on goal. Make Tierney work in there. So far, she, they've had nice shots, but they've all gone wide. Tierney with the kick here. Miss Honan guards the net. Tierney kicks it straight up the middle. Forey tries to get that. She gets knocked down. Keister with the ball. Johnny Ray Corrier. Keister with the ball again. Broken up by Philly on solid defensive play there. Clark with the ball now. Gets it broken up. McAllister takes it. Snyder with the ball. Four he goes down. Gets up slow once again. Hashkin broken up by Amanda Forey. Good play there. She would if she would have got by Forey, that would have been a very solid scoring opportunity before he breaks that play up. Looks like the Cougars are overloading on defense right now. Is that what you want to be doing with all with twelve minutes still left in the half? It's one nothing here with eleven minutes, thirty seconds left in the second half of this game tonight. Another shot by wide by Asable. Goal kick here. Tierney with the kick. Corey with the ball. Corey gets it knocked out of bounds. Wait throw. Corey throws it in. Made a to chasing. Kicked over her head. Corey with the ball. Rabadu chasing. She gets to it. Tries to push it over to Bayshard, but misplayed. Forey with the ball. Touched by Rabadu. Rabadu chasing along with Samantha Ashline. Rabadu gets to it. Cuts it to the center. Just wide of the net. Good try there by Rabadu trying to cross that ball. Yes, excellent job. Keeper comes out, watches it go wide. Uh, the shots look to be 15 for the Cougars and about 8 for Osable right now. Doing an excellent job, Osable, getting some offense so far this half. Yes, the past 5 6 minutes, Osable's been putting on the pressure in the Cougars' defensive zone. As Bayshard gets the ball now, gets it broken up by Senor. Senor with the ball. Broken up. Over to Clark. Clark gets it broken up by Senor. Senor passes it up to Keiser. Keiser moves it up. To the side of Senior. Senior breaking off of D. She's breaking in. Gets it to Carter in the 18. Misplayed. And Tierney comes out and gets the ball. Looks like Carter's limping. Looks like she's uh, got an injury so far this half. 
Tierney with an excellent punt there. Yes, Carter did go out in the first half for a little while with that injury. So it could be something that has to do with that. Corey with the ball. Touches it to the end line. Brooke Prey gets to it. Corey ch tries to keep that in. She doesn't. Looks to be goal kick for the Patriots here. The Patriots are going to try and boot this one up and try to generate a scoring chance here with nine minutes left in the second half. Uh, keeper right now going to take this, smoke it up the field. Blocked by Jen Bashard. Jen Bashard cuts the center, crosses it right onto the net. Saved by the goalie. Good save there. Jen Bashard with a nice shot on net. Keyser with the ball, touches it over to Hashkin, back to Keyser. Patriots are doing very good with those little give and go passes so far this half. Touches up to Carter, offsides there, good call by the ref. She just broke ahead before the ball got there. If it wasn't offsides, it would have been a great scoring chance for Carter. Um, I don't see how that was offsides on the kick there. On the kick, you're allowed, if she was on sides and then the ball passed, or you can get a, it's on the kick. So that's the ref call, ref's call, so Honan's going to take the kick here. Try to boot it out of the zone. Throw in for the Patriots. Into the center. Keyser gets the ball, touches over to Senior. Senior with the ball. Keyser on net. Saved by Tierney. Tierney's getting a lot of good looks here. That looks like to be the first shot on net this half by a Sable doing an excellent job. Yes, uh, Sable is putting the pressure on here, trying to equalize this game, send it into overtime. Corey missed that, but Colleen's there to break it up. Jordan Clark is breaking down the side, makes her move, keeps going down. She's going down the left side, cuts back, crosses it over, intended for Corey, but doesn't get there. Danny Boris crosses it over, gives it to Amanda Rabideau. Rabideau pushes it over to Corey. We have seven minutes left here in the second half. The Cougars lead 1-0 over the Osceola Valley Patriots. Carter with the ball now for the Patriots. Broken up by Forey. Carter has the ball again. But Forey gets back. Oh, Carter regains the ball. Breaks it into the 18. Makes her move. Breaks it by. Brings it back to Hashkin. Hashkin stepping up. Hashkin with the kick. Blocked by Honan. Good play by Honan. Four kicks it over to Rabideau. Miss, miss trap, but back into the zone. Four kicks it out. She gets taken out. Good play, or good call by Rafa, I mean. Uh, look for us able to get some desperation shots. Tw closing in on the six minute mark left in the regulation. And if us able scores, looks like we might go to two minute, two ten minute overtimes. Corey with the ball. Pushes it up, Rabideau chasing, now Corey chasing, Prey gets to it first, goes out, blue throw deep in their own territory, throwing in to Hashkin, Hashkin tries to get the ball by but Rabideau breaks that up, kicked out, Corey cuts that off and kicks it into the center, looks to be going on goal. Right to Cor Clark. Clark kicks it over to Jen Bashar. Jen Bashar just misses it. Perfect scoring opportunity there. Just Jen Bashar just couldn't get her foot on it. A nice play by Corey though to get that one to the center of the net. Jen Bashar doing an excellent job being a sub coming in on with uh, five minutes left. You gotta stay warm, keep the ball out of your own end. Good point. Rob do it to throw in. She gets the ball back, boots it into the center, broken up. <laughs> Throw in here for the Cougars. Forey throws it in. Clark cutting to the center, makes her move around two defenders. Gets blocked, but she gets the ball back, makes her move, cut, cuts it back to the middle, goes wide. 
Goal kick here for the Patriots. All the players are look, seems to be getting very cold, trying to move around and get warm here tonight. Patriots desperately need that equalizer. It's, they're going to try and get into the Cougars' half. Four gets that one in to Clark, and Clark just puts that one over. Another goal kick here. This is what the Cougars are going to try and do, just try to run the clock out and keep this game at a one nothing win for them. Kick, a little short pass again. But it gets broken up. The Cougars are reading that very well tonight. Boris traps that. Fillion gets to the ball. Forey now. Pushes it over. Duty. Er, Corey, excuse me. Put, puts it to the center. Kicked out of harm's way. But Corey is there with the ball. Corey puts it on net. But the goalie comes out and gets that. Nice, another nice put to the net by Corey. Keeper for Frost Sable is doing an excellent job tonight. Well played. One mishap. Look for her to be the star for the Sable so far tonight. Yes, as we just a little over three minutes left in the second half of this game with the Cougars leading one nothing. Ball goes out. Patriots throw. Out of bounds again. Now Cougars throw. Rabu throws it in. In the Clark. Clark hits the ball. Rabideau now with the ball. Rabideau gets broken up by Snyder. Now Hash again. Up to Kieser. Kieser puts it up to Snyder. Snyder's breaking, but broken up by Filion. And Honan's back to get that ball. Honan kicks it up. Blocked by Snyder, but Honan gets it back and kicks it back up to For Corey. Now Forey with the ball. Heads it. Bashard comes back to get it. Forey touches it over to Corey. Broken up. Jen Bashar with the ball now. Just goes out. Cougars are just going to try and finish this game off and take the game for 1 nothing with 2 minutes and 20 seconds left in the second half. Cougars are playing some excellent boom ball, keeping the ball out of their own end. That's what you want to do when you have this kind of lead. And the wind's whipping, so you don't want to get it up in the air. Yes, the wind has really picked up in the past few minutes. The wind's really whipping across here. The balls need to stay low, or else it's just going to carry. Jordan Clark now in the corner working it. Pushes it over. Out of bounds again. Another oh corner kick now. This is where the Cougars are going to want to try and maybe just score and finish it off here. Look for the Cougars to run the time on this one. Milk it for all they can. Yes, yeah, so we're just a minute and 45 seconds left. Clark kicks it over. Trapped by Forey. Over to Corey. Corey tries to pass it in to the middle. Back over. But it's broken up. Forey gets the ball. Now Corey. Corey tries for the slide tackle. She misses. She's getting up slow. It's very cold, so injuries are prone tonight. Broken up by Hashkin. Hashkin moves it up to number 23. Broken up by Amanda Forey. Just as we're the closing seconds were just as a minute minute left in the second half here. Cougars leading one nothing. They just want to try to run this time out and Patriots are gonna try and score a desperation goal here at the end. Corey with a nice slide tackle right there, all ball then kicks it up. Gets it up to Keister. Keister now with the ball. They're gonna double team her. She gets by. Honan gets it. Gets it into the middle. Chases by twenty number twenty three. Keeps it in. Good play by Philly and breaks that up just wide as a shot on goal. Closing seconds here in the first half. 30 seconds left. Have a corner kick here. This is going to be the best chance for the Patriots to tie this game up. Look for a long ball here for the Patriots. You want to get this one as far as you can into the six yard box. And if you get it there, look for a header into the goal. Looks like this is going to be our last chance. Yes, yeah, so as there's 12 seconds left. Keiser is going to take the kick. And she kicks it, gets to the middle, but it's kicked out by Philion. Nice play by Philion. One second left, and game over now. What a great game tonight, as it has been very cold, and the Cougars come out with a 1 0 win. We hope you have enjoyed our broadcast of Champlain Valley Athletic Conference High School Soccer, and we thank you for joining us. We hope you will look for future sports programming from the Cougar Sports Network right here on Hometown Cable.
for Bobby Peeper, this is Josh Bayshard reminding you that the final score of tonight's contest was Northeastern Cougars 1, Osceola Valley Patriots 0. This has been an all-student production of the Cougar Sports Network in cooperation with Hometown Cable.